Good afternoon, peeps. Good afternoon. The next wonderful day on the beach again. This man, NASA links check in again once more. So, in this afternoon, I'm gonna talk about a whole monument in Jamaica, the first prison built in Jamaica. So, this, this evening video is gonna be a history video, right? So, stay tuned, subscribe, hit the notification bell. So when you post a video, you get notified. Yes, I'm going along, right? So, this prison now was the first jailhouse built in Jamaica. I guess it was built by the English. It wasn't a prison at first. It was built as a fort. That's a F-O-R-T. Not a fortress. That simple mean, no, it was actually a defense area, a military area. So I guess to defend this side of the coastline from the, the, the invading Spanish. It wa was actually a defense area at first. Until it declared useless in 1795. And it was built in 1750 as a fort and then declared useless in 1795 because of rising sea level that's encroaching sea level and this jailhouse located in St. Anne's Bay, Jamaica right on the Fisherman Beach so my information I get about this place now it's an old monument as you can see right on the Fisherman Beach so the fishermen them use it to to camp, to build them camp inside and around it. Because you know fishermen as some of them live some distance away from the beach. So each one of them have them camp with them build up. And somebody commented on the, the first video and said that the government should pay more attention and save this place for a younger generation. And that's true. I strongly believe that. But the government is still have control over this place right now. Because it on a, the fisherman beach and a strongly it run by the government. But the little information that's there about this building. I don't know why there is so little information. Only the time when it build and when it becomes a when it becomes a, a jailhouse and what it was before the jailhouse. So I'm not sure why there's such little information about this and it's the first prison building in Jamaica, the first jailhouse. So what me gather from the locals you now, the fishermen and the surrounding people is that after it becomes the, the jailhouse in 1795, it was used as a, as a slave market because this is the channel that the ship will come through because out in the sea is a channel. I do a video about a blue hole and I said that's where Christopher Columbus ship sink down by the blue hole. So it's a channel and the warehouse is down that side as well too. So you can see everything take time connecting. So the information that I gathered was a slave market that this is where the slave them would first step off the ship come from Africa for the slave trade so all of that will take would take place at this old jailhouse and I kind of heard some things like some hanging business used to take place at this jailhouse they used to have a hungry cause that's a nice word to, 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 to call it a hungry and then across the road and the ball field now is actually a ball field now. They used to have a second hangar. So they move it from the, 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 the old jailhouse and take it over by the ball field. That's a couple chains across the road, a few meters across the road from the, um, the old jailhouse. So this old monument now, there's not a lot about it. So. From my experience and my learning about this, I'm just here to share what I think and what I've learned about this place. So, this is the first jailhouse built in 1750, declared useless in 1795. 
because of encroaching sea level that high sea level like the sea coming to take it over and then after that it becomes the first GLOs the first slavery GLOs I'm not sure exactly the type of jailers that it was attracting differently from the slave. And next elder did have said to me, say, this place was the, the slavery trade place. So a lot of people die and hang, black slaves die and hang at this location. No, and the place is a very old monument building. You can see from some of the makings, a lot of old cut stone and old boards you can see some of the, the, the building cut is still visible that's the information i got about this place still and what i have learned about this place is that it's a slavery trade area so this is where all the the slave that come at this point in center and will, will actually come off the ship at first so it was a big market that they sell slaves to go to other plantations on the island all over the island and I guess here is not the only place this, this slave chain take place I guess it takes place in different areas as well but here is one of the main because it's here is St. Anne's them say Christopher Columbus first that up close to this area very close and just a couple meters away his ship sink and there's out by the sea close to the beach there's a channel that the ship used to take the ship route so at this location it's an old slavery prison the first prison the first jailhouse in Jamaica located in St. Anne's Bay and the fisherman beach of St. Anne's Bay so if anybody else have any info about this place and would like to share that info please leave it in the comment numbers wise in at the and the channel art you can reach by email or call or whatsapp so anybody have any info to drop please feel free to leave a comment what you think and what the government should do about this place Yes, so and the fishermen them they all own the right to this place as well. So if the government is going to do anything, please include the fishermen as well. Because this place could sit as a era that you can show our younger children that this is what happened and this is the first thing built in Jamaica. As that as someone comment on um, my previous video and said the government should and I think they should because this place is actually only a, only four line actually line out this place and it does not give you a direct location where this place actually is you have to come and ask someone you just say this place is located in St. Anne's Bay but St. Anne's Bay is a, is a big place so it's located on the Fisherman Beach. Located on the Fisherman Beach of St. Anne's Bay. The old jail house. The first prison built in Jamaica. This is that old monument. So once more again peeps, NASA links with this update about this old building and what the purpose it was serving in 1795 up and up. And from 1750 the build date to 1795 when it turned into the, the GLOs. NASA links here are check out now so remember to subscribe remember to remember to hit the notification bell for my for my latest updates yes okay so NASA links are check out